you understand foreign policy, you understand foreign relations. What does China and Russia have to do with all of this? First of all, is there a, a, like almost a, you know, not complacency, but has China given this the, its blessing? Um, I think China is trying to be helpful to a certain extent, uh, but let's be very clear. The favored option for China is the status quo, all of this. In terms of Russia, it's very interesting. Lavrov, the Russian foreign minister, was in North Korea on the 31st of May. So they feeling that they, they are certainly feeling they are a bit on the, on the on the back foot on this one, but they are they. And indeed, I think if there is anything happening out of this meeting, we will see a flurry of diplomatic activities involving other countries in the region um, after this one, assuming there is some progress. Um, Vufanga, what are the chances of this actually succeeding? Is it a 50-50? Is it a 70-30? Is it a I think it depends what you define by success here. Okay, how do you should, define it? The expectation should be very low. I mean, usually when we have seen, leaving aside the personality, so much has been said about the individuals involved, which is, you know, is interesting choreography, is good for show, but reality here is that this negotiation usually takes months to prepare, and right. we don't have months about that. So here, at best, we should expect something about the peace process, how we can get to a peace deal between North Korea and the U.S. So to conclude the Korean War, yeah. um, potentially, and then an indication of what is next, what is the sequencing here. That will be the best case scenario coming out of this uh, at the end of the day. Because still, we don't know what is on the menu. Are we talking about the nukes? Are we talking about conventional weapons? Are we talking about human rights? Um, um, what is the depth to how ambitious they want to be? What is the verification system that you put in place? What is the sequencing? And um, so there is lots of still question mark here. I mean, you could argue that actually both leaders want a quick win. Right? There is no quick win here. There is no quick win here that can be a game changer. The quick win here is let's agree to talk more. 